Thank you so much. So it's an honor to me to stay here. At, it's my first time at World Camp Miami. And probably already seen that my native language is not English. I talk, I live in Brazil, in the south of Brazil, so my main language is Portuguese. So forgive me for some of my, the mistakes I may, I may do on this talk. Okay, so I will talk a little about me and I will, I will speak about how to integrate the WordPress REST API with some device like, like a Raspberry Pi, okay? So I live in the south of Brazil, as I say. I am a developer, I am a teacher, I am a father, I am a husband. I work almost 10 years with WordPress like anyone. It's a normal life like any other type of life. So this is a, a small information. Last year, I traveled around these places, talking in some work camps around the world. This is my life during my days. We work with my son, drinking a chimarron, this a mate, driving my bike with my dog, and so on. I work at TopTal. TopTal is a global network with the best freelancers on the entire world. We have designers, developers, and financial experts. So if someone wants to have more information about TopTal, you can reach me over the talk, and you can click on the link and apply if you want. OK? So we don't have time to lose. Let's go to the main topic of this talk. This is our agenda. I will explain to you each one of these topics. What are the challenges, the landscape, uh, a huge view of this uh, project, the reference I have used, and a little overview about the REST API. I will talk about the package I have used to get the decibels that you may do on the screen. I will do a live code to explain the project and, of course, a live preview. So, my main challenge is try to show to everyone that it's possible to use the REST API with someone else, like not only um, React application or an Angular application or any kind of JS application. So I try to use this with some device and interactly with somehow with the audience that I have here today. So to do this, I think in this landscape. So the main idea is to ask you to scream as loud as you can something, OK? And this little camera will capture the decibels. And if you reach, if we reach a certain number, the Raspberry Pi will publish a post on my website with some information and with some pictures that this webcam will take. So this is the main idea, okay? Let's see if this is work. I tested there and it works. I think it will work as well. So a quick overview about the REST API and the possibilities that we have with the REST API. Normally the people that use the REST API of WordPress use to create some front-end application for a mobile device, stuff like this. Normally using Angular, React, Vue, and any other kind of um, these modern JavaScript frameworks in these days. With the REST API, it's possible to do almost anything we can do with WordPress backend. So we can create posts, custom posts, taxonomies, configure, uh, options and customizations, and so on. So the REST API uses normally the HTTP, HTTP methods like uh, post, get, and put, and delete to do the actions inside the WordPress. And you don't need to know anything about PHP language. You just need to know JavaScript to, to use the REST API. So I have used inside this Raspberry Pi only JavaScript to do this task, okay? 
and I will show to you how this works. So the REST API of WordPress, it's very simple. It's, some, it's similar to any other REST API. We can create something, we can update something, we can delete something, we can list topics. And I have used two endpoints for this presentation. The first one is to the endpoint for posts, and the second one is to the media endpoint to upload the picture this camera will take, okay? I already talked about this. Okay. I search on the web and try to find a package that can capture the song, the songs or the noises that I have in some an environment. And I found I found the decibel meter package. This is a normal NPM package. Okay? I just installed this directly on my Raspberry Pi and it works as well. Here is some ref references about the, the libraries or the stuff I have used to build this project, okay? So this project is on GitHub, on my, account, on my profile. It's the first link there. I have used the REST API of WordPress, of course. I have used the decibel package meter. I have used the express package of NPM to run on the Raspberry Pi a local server. And I have used this gift shot. It's, this is a JavaScript framework that uh, can get the pictures of this camera and create a small GIF with this, with this uh, framework. And I can do what I, I want to do with this, this framework. Okay, so I will show to you the code because it's important to understand. I don't know if everyone is, everyone can read? No? It's too small, I think so. Let me see. Where is this? Where is the size? No, oh, thank you. It's better? Okay. So, uh, as I talk with you, it's simple. I have main, many assets here. This is only the CSS. There is nothing different there. Images and the JavaScript part. So, um, I create these main uh, two functions. The first one is to take a shot using this camera. Here's, uh, here I am using the GIF shot framework. And here I start a process to listen to the songs that will be uh, made for you guys during the presentation, okay? So here's another method to use with the decibel package meter. Here's the framework, here's the REST API. So here is the comments that I use it to post these result on my WordPress website. So here I publish the post. I have some types of Ajax. I just call an Ajax with the uh, credentials. And here I use to upload the image. It's very similar. I just need to append more information like the title of the, the media and the, the base 64 content to publish inside the environment. And what else? Oh, I think that's it. This is the main idea of the project. So let's run and see what's happened. So let's see if everything is running here. It's okay. Okay, so when I start, we can start like a 50 to test. And when I click on the start listen, it's important to all of you scream something like "Word Camp Miami and raise your hands because this will be recorded and we go to my website, okay? Okay? So, are you ready? Okay, so let's go. 
World Game Miami! No, 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 no. <laughs> Let's try something like third. I think this is okay. Okay, ready, set, go. World Game Miami! I think it works. I think it works. Let's see if the camera is working. Yeah, it's working. Probably this will take some time, like uh, a minute or something like this, because I am using my LT, and LT network, and there is the image. Cool. Cool. So let me see if it works. Okay. Not yet, but it's coming. <laughs> okay, we don't have errors, so it's coming. Not yet. But needs to work. Problem is my connection because I am, I am using my cell phone connection to connect the Raspberry Pi in my computer in my own network. So let's see. Not yet. Camera, stop it. Okay. Oh, oops. Let's try one more time, okay? It's early in the morning. You have breath to scream. Okay. I will set to 30 again. Ready? Okay, Seti. Go! World Game Miami! Yeah! It works! Okay, so probably now it's working. The picture is taken, yeah. Yeah, probably, yeah? Oh, awesome, it works. So if you want to see the result, you can reach this link, rest.donini.me, and you see your picture there, and the value of your, the decibels you reach, okay? Yeah, now it works. So this is the review. That's it. It's very simple. So as you can see, you just need something like uh, eight hours. I think I have used eight hours to build this stuff. I get my Raspberry Pi, install the Raspberry Pi, the, the OS, and get some reference about the, the, the Cibel package, install of, in this small device, this small device here, and all of this works. So anyone have any question regarding to this presentation? Did you like it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> any questions? Go ahead. No, no. Using for a final client, you mean? Yeah, like the final mm. application or interactive like installation or something like that. No, no, I don't I don't have made anything like this till now. Yeah. Okay. Only this. Okay. Yeah. Here.
Go ahead. Uh, yeah, yeah. Go, uh, yes, yes. Go, so, ask again. I was wondering if there's anything additional needed now to use the API. Because I know last year you needed to use like a special plugin in order to use the API. So I'm not sure if that's still no, needed. The, no, yeah, I understood. No, the, the API, now it's inside the WordPress car. You don't need to install anything else to use it. If you install the last the last version of WordPress, you have the REST API. Yeah. Any else? Any other questions? There. How do you handle authentication your WordPress site? Okay. How I handle the authentication to post using the REST API? I have used a plugin to do this task for me. I am using the simple authentication or something like this. The name of the plugin is, let's see, JSON Page Authentication, the first one, here. So you just need to install and use any user that have admin credential, uh, at the admin role inside your system to post stuff there. Any else? Nope. So, Thank you. I will be the happiness bar if oh. someone wants to talk with me. Thank you. Wonderful. Yeah, well, are yeah. you playing around? Who's playing around with Raspberry Pis here? Mm -hmm. All right, okay. So, 